Your brain is an energy-hungry organ. Although it weighs a mere 3 pounds, which is only 2% of an average body's weight, it consumes more than 20% of your daily energy budget. To put this into perspective, if your total calorie burn for the day is 1300 calories, then your brain consumes 260 of those calories just to keep things in order. That's nearly 11 calories every hour. 15% of your cardiac output and 20% of your total oxygen supply also goes towards powering your brain. Considering its small size, one might wonder, what does the brain need so much fuel for? And does this energy consumption go down when we are at rest? Well, your brain is comprised of neurons. These cells communicate with each other and transmit messages to and from body tissues. Neurons produce chemicals called neurotransmitters to relay their signals. To produce neurotransmitters, neurons extract 75% of the sugar glucose obtained from the food you eat and 20% of the oxygen from your blood. The remaining energy is used for maintaining healthy nerve cells and cleaning up unhealthy ones. But researchers have found that 90% of the energy used by the brain remains unaccounted for. This means that, as far as we know, your brain uses a great amount of energy doing nothing. Now. You'd think that your brain is doing less work when the rest of you is asleep, right? Wrong. The brain uses similar energy levels when at rest as compared to when it's doing something massively complicated. But why is this the case? To answer this question, IBM researchers proposed the grand loop theory of the brain. According to this theory, the human brain is actually always looping signals through its neural pathways. It is continually exploring the senses, the emotions, and the behaviors even while the body is at rest. Although it may seem like the brain is doing nothing, it is actually assembling a map of accumulating information and experiences that we can fall back on when making decisions in our day-to-day -day lives. This constant exploration explains why the brain uses so much energy. While we know that the brain burns as much energy regardless of whether you're sleeping or awake, PET scans have revealed that your brain doesn't burn energy uniformly. If a specific task requires a certain area of the brain, that area's energy needs are going to increase. For example, the frontal lobe of your brain is where your thinking takes place. So, if you are doing mental work, your frontal lobe is going to be telling the other areas of your brain that it needs the energy more than they do. This was shown in a study where half of the test subjects completed complex verbal and math problems while the other half mindlessly pressed a key on repeat. Those who were completing the complex tasks showed a significant drop in blood glucose levels, which suggested a greater energy expenditure. Certain brain functions also require more energy than others. For example, the brain areas responsible for hearing require more energy than the areas responsible for our sense of smell. Hearing requires very fast and precise signaling. After all, it wouldn't be advantageous for the sound of danger to be delayed in any way. On the other hand, slow processes like smell don't have the same intense energy needs. Simply put, your brain is a complex powerhouse that needs proper fuel. Make sure you're consuming enough calories to give your brain what it needs to function or you will absolutely start to feel the consequences. Calorie needs can change based on what type of life you live, so be sure to speak with your doctor and find out what your body, and especially your brain, need to be healthy.